Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you very much. We at CBS News and 60 Minutes Weekday are deeply grateful for this award to the University of Georgia, to the Peabody Board, to the judges, and to all, each and every one who are responsible for bestowing this recognition. You have our respect, admiration, and appreciation. I want to add my personal gratitude to those at the core of finding, reporting, and taking to air this difficult story. Producer Mary Mapes, Associate Producer Dana Roberson, who could not be with us today, our military expert, retired United States Marine Lieutenant Colonel Roger Charles, and our tape editor, Mary Alfieri. They did most of the work, bore the heaviest burdens, and took a lot of heat before, during, and after the broadcast of this investigative report. This story took a lot of hard work and digging. They did it. It took guts. They had them. Thanks also to those who were involved in overall supervision and leadership positions, most especially executive producer Jeffrey Fager, senior producer Patty Hassler, Mike Whitney, the great Arthur Bloom, our director, Vice President Betsy West. These are all experienced professionals who have a passion for news and for their country. When it comes to striving to meet the responsibilities of the public trust that is the practice of journalism in this country, these are people who love right more than ease and honor above honors. I'm proud to work for and with them, proud to have them watching my back and at my side. In their name and on their behalf, I humbly accept this award and join them in hoping that this recognition will further inspire us and others to never give up, never back up, never give in, while pursuing the dream of doing integrity-filled journalism that matters. Thank you.